The message you're about to listen to is a message from Apostle Eric Nyamiche, the chairman of the Church of Pentecost. Apostle Eric Nyamiche preaches the gospel in its simplest form to help the believers walk in Christ and also how the believer relate with his world. This year, the message is on unleashing the church to possess nation. Join us and let's learn from Apostle Eric Nyamiche and be a blessing to the world. If you are new to this page, make sure that you subscribe to the channel and turn on that notification bell so that when new videos are uploaded, you can have access to it. Make sure you go to our own page and check out for more videos. Thank you. Reconciliation. Bringing into agreement or harmony. To win over friendliness is what we mean by reconciliation. And Kabum and answer, yeah, Pata, near Kabum, and I say, yeah, Bomodin say, you beat me in your Ionko first runko, and I say, yeah, de Nanfuyano, a bebu. Bringing into agreement or harmony. The yeah, Bomodin say, yeah, de Yankoye, and I say, Nanfufano, a beba, a bumbu. To win over to friendliness. Now, and no aqua aqua could do, say, you beat me a dunkunim, and ya Ionko first runko. But we are looking at the same test. Now, yes, yeah. Matthew chapter 5 23 and 24 Matthew 5 23 and 24 Therefore if you are offering your gift at the altar and there remember that your brother or sister has something against you leave your gift there in front of the altar First go and be reconciled to them. Then come and offer your gift. And this is what you are here about for him to know. Now what I say, who knew no was someone. Ja, why are you here now for him to know? And him why? Now what? Now when you know no enko bom kane and sana waba abemma why are you here now? Now we said that this is a new form of righteousness. Ya can say we a ye three ni sun kwa o nyame di adumi. And that this one as has the new in the spirit within that the born again spirit is able to meet the demands of these scriptures. Let's take the by the scripture again. Therefore, if you are offering your gift at the altar, and then remember that your brother or sister. Now, this is very kind, your brother or sister. Normally, the people who have things against you, they, they may not be your brothers or sister. Yeah, have something against you. Leave your gift there in front of the altar. First, go and be reconciled to them. Then come and offer your gift. For him, Tiano, and Nimwa. Now, call now when you are no boom cane and sana, what be ma, why are you dear? Now, what Jesus seems to be saying here is that we cannot be right with God until we are right with one another. Now, yes, a patcher and say, and to me, ma, see a ninja and coupon, a bit matina, kama, ye ni ubi, a wasem. We cannot be right with God. Until we are right with one another. So let's take the scripture again. Therefore, if you are offering your gift at the altar, and then remember that your brother or sister has something against you. Mm. Leave your gift there. In front of the altar. First, go and be reconciled to them. Then come and offer your gifts. Now, my interest in this particular verse is also the word first. Now the word first means being before all others. Or before anything else. In respect to time, order, 
rank and importance. So he said, leave your gift there in front of the altar first before all others. Not just say for a year, dear no. Now, before anything else, huh? including opening prayer. Now, answer now, be you be a just say, who would have saw them walk right in your mom pie or Before anything else, and no, I did the kind of a sister way of crowns away in respect to time. A brim po and only deep brain, no, any more than Senior, yes, the assistant woman rank. And this is normal. It did normal. It's important. And this is normal. Be here. So, so what Jesus is saying is of utmost importance. I just said, yes, which one is it? And no, it did. I didn't know. Can I? Leaving your gift on the altar, going to reconcile is. It counts before any other thing. Not just a Uja, why yeah, 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 now for him, which I know, not what Konuniano, a co bomono, and new here, a chamber, be as a dinning in a cane. Now it towers above your offering. Now she, a yah, a chamber for the enimbo. It is more important than any other. A yah, a chamber, beer. First go and be reconciled to them. Then come and offer your gifts. Now, 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 Reconciliation with the person who has something against you takes precedence over the offering that one has to offer in worship. Now pay attention to this. Now, according to the scripture, the one who initiates the reconciliation is the one who has wronged the other person. He says that if you remember that someone has something against you. And so the initiative is taken by the one who feels that he has wronged someone. Now when Jesus was speaking to the disciples, they actually understood him. He was just reminding them of a, the Jewish principle which they all knew very well. Now so for a sacrifice or an, an offering to be effective, the sacrifice has to include confession of sin or true penitence. Now we have said that to confess is to acknowledge, admit by way of revelation the true state of one's heart. It is the pouring out of facts hitherto suppressed to God or to someone or to a perceived offender with the intention of making peace and or receiving forgiveness and favor. You did can say who pay mu akano and it say who can be a free mu and a dear mu a fat bribe a yo se ubi a ye a tiao and na se bribe a mauni ubin tem and yo na weno nia uye ni na ne bota and se ube to me ni nipano and yan kabom and na ube nya bonifa free and an enimadum. Now we have said that confession must be true and sincere. You did can say you see all true penitence or repentance involve the attempt to rectify any consequences sin or any action might have caused now hold this one i want you to pay attention to this and then if you like let's read together any true penitence or repentance involve the attempt to rectify any consequences sin or the offense or an action might have 
hard. Bribiema ubi epe maka ana wasachira na gwea oye no nukure muno niya oshe ni se se nipani ye boni biya nsi nsa nsuo boni bi ebe bano soa ube tu miya gane saadi eno eni. So in true repentance we are expecting that someone will have do some reconciliation or some restitution. Enti now you make amends for the wrong or the injury done or you make some compensation yeah so when we talk about reconciliation we are saying that we are bringing to into agreement or harmony. And the cancer, ye can boom and I say didn't come boom eba. Not just a dear no send and I mean Tim wants a woman, your bomb or didn't say Babuano, na young kufa abba. We are winning over to friendliness. Your bomb or didn't say ye de a young kuye and na any or dread die and terminal a beba bio. But when we talk about restitution, we are saying that you are making amends for a wrong. Now ye can so be a trip be a wasser no car, not just a near wasser no bomb or didn't say of this you see a beba. Awesome compensation but reconciliation and restitution are products of genuine repentance and so say yes such a yagin nani ya say no no yet ya kano if ya kuma aya kradu say a best such a nagini no criminal now let's go to luke chapter 19 mommy and she look at some panel it didn't grow it's a very popular illustration there we in your name say and she swap to do on a name that i'll take from verse 7 Look 19 from 7. Look at Sempano, it in Kruny Munson. All the people saw this and began to matter. He had gone to be the guest of a sinner. Now, for whom you know, when you know, you know, I can say, or a call, I could see a berima, or yet, or the boyeni. Bazakios, that is the sinner's name. Bazakios stood up and said to the Lord, Look, Lord. Here and now, I give half of my possessions to the poor. And if I have cheated anybody out of anything, I will pay back four times the amount. Nasakio, jina kachire, uradi se, uradi, she, me di ma, hudi e fa, me che e yin afo, nasa me na mkonto mpo so ma ji, obi pribia, me bon hon empre nain, me chiaka. I like Zacchaeus. Me need Jezakio, mon papa. Especially when he use the word if. He, he himself, he knows that. <laughs> nah, okay, say, 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 he knows be. what he has. That word is if. <laughs> yeah. Because he was a task collector. <laughs> He's, He's not continue. born again, so he was coming in. Small, small. If I have cheated anybody. Out of anything. I will pay back four times the amount that is compensation. Me making amends. Me bon and pray nine me chia send you panic and just say or bon modern send ya was saying no no obesity. But this is an evidence of true repentance. Now we a yinina swear chess and nipano was such an agreement. So let's listen to Jesus. Jesus said to him, Yes, you can't say today salvation has come to this house. And then I'm quite about fear you because this man two is a son of abraham if you say oh no so yeah abraham ba now yeah salvation has come to his hand because he's willing to reconcile he's willing to make amends now i i have had this friend we used to be going to church together very good friend yeah madam for you and then we I was preaching in a classroom. Now it was his former school. Then I was talking about repentance, genuine repentance and all that. We're going to have a protracted meeting. At a point I was not seeing him. <laughs> <laughs> he got lost. Then he appeared. And was saying, mm. you know what? 
When he was leaving that school, bra free school no no. He stole a number of textbooks. Huma, would you see idea no? Now, what's the sum? Number of them. What's the sum? Later on, I was wondering what he was going to do with them. Now, actually, no, nim the audio quiet. But he had all these textbooks with him in his house. Now, so now, Huma, yeah, where we are now, Nina, I want to, I want to see. So, in the middle of the message, and he, bra, oti ni amesem no. He decided to go home every one. No, yes, and he, obe kofi, no wa kosi sa Huma, where we are Nina, Eddie Aba. And so when we close, he said, Eric, see, I took this test. I said, I'm not the headmaster. <laughs> Why give it to the headmaster? See, point, you know, and I said, Rerick, who am I? I said, you know, you know, I said, so go in, you know, and I'm down, you know, you're down, you know, then they follow in there. Now, I did it, you know, for the boldness. Oh, shit, I could drop out, no, and yes, and the spirit that is, that is, uh, born again, truly penitent spirit, and send these books to the head teacher. And whom are and no no so best actor now, you know, or the Nina Co Ecoma Siano, and I say, uh, Sukunu Mupenino. The teacher was shocked with surprise. Chacha for Penino, a yen one way ye. Instead of receiving the books, now all the woman who are you rather told him to sit in his office. Now answer and no catcher and say, Untina, the beer, now. He went to call two other teachers to come and listen to what this young man has done. He went to call two other teachers church do you attend? to call two mentioned the name of his church. Then the head teacher said, see, I'm a church of open you see I'm a chorister in this church otherwise I would have joined your church oh I'm <laughs> sorry I make we me and I'm a shock I for so and this are can we do it yeah sorry see we cannot be right with God I don't know you to me in your coupon and mom and until until we are right with one another this is a yeah in the pain you know at it as some dream when Jesus taught the Lord's prayer he said that forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us. Or if I am from so free and send your so you do free one or dying. Now, which one counts first? You forgive others first, then God will also forgive your sins. You cannot be right with God. Until you are right with one another. We cannot be right with God. Until we are right with one another. Until we have done our best to remove the practical consequences of sin or an offense has caused. You bet to me a ye bonin soon so and so and I say yaw dear who soon so and so be a free one. But there is a big but. And so, we need to examine this scripture carefully. Otherwise, and yes, all of us will have to leave the church house, go looking for fellows who have something against us. And this I see in our southern yes, you are you free. Oh, you are quite sure you will be. It will be a how many of us here don't have somebody holding a grudge against you? I don't want my church house to be empty on Sunday. So please, let's examine this scripture in the light of the broad word of God. Yes. Because. Because. Someone may have something against you. But is that really the case? Is that really the case that he has something against you? One may be offended because you took your stand on a matter. Or you set the record straight like we have said the idea or probably because you didn't give in to an evil demand so this fellow has something against you and you can remember 
So do you leave your offering and go looking for this person? We'll continue next week. Yeah, we'll continue next week. We have to just look at the scripture again. So let's go back to the scripture. Therefore, if you are offering your gift at the altar, and then remember that your brother or sister has something against you, and I'm saying that people have things against us. Leave your offering in front of the altar. First go and be reconciled to them. Na then come and offer your gifts. So we'll continue next week by the grace of God.